Hi guys, this is Dan and welcome to my third installment of my Photoshop tutorial videos. In this video I'll be showing you how to create a glossy metallic layer style for text, objects, pictures and background images. So as you see here on my layer 1, which is my shape, uh, I have the glossy style, I also have it on this uh, in swirl here, using the pencil. Uh, so you can see the glossiness and the contours uh, implemented with this layer style. Um, it overall just looks metallic, it's quite nice text as well, it works quite well on text. So let's just get stuck in, we're going to file, new, create a new document, your background size, name, whatever you want. Once you um, create your document, you want to create a, uh, a gradient for your background. So I'm going to go in reverse. Okay, once you create that, you want to create a new layer and come to your shape tool, hold down left click, go to custom shape tool. Find the shape you want to use. I'm just going to use a arrow while dragging. Hold shift and all. Keep it center aligned. Um, I'm going to change the color. It's more manageable color while we create this. Okay, so when I get shape, you're going to want to right click and go blending options. This is where we're going to create the um, glossy contoured metallic look. So we're going to go straight to bevel and boss. Uh, inner bevel and smooth are fine, depth you want about 340 to 341 in the depth. You want the size to be about 250 pixels and the softness to be zero. Angle to be 120 and gloss contour you want to be number 10, which is this one here. Highlight mode screen and set to about 25%. Highlight mode to, no, uh, to screen again. And set to about 28%. That should do that. Straight to a contour. I'm just leave that as it is. That should do it. It just raises the contour level line a bit. Straight into stroke. I'm going to make a stroke of 8. Um, blend mode normal. So blend mode multiply. And then I'm going to have a gradient fill type. Um, you want your first stop to be white. As well as your last stop. Uh, you move to the center and type in the text code which I found I got earlier from my previous one and that is E sorry C E C F E zero to be a light grey effect. Okay that and then the angle should be at about 120 degrees. Ah uh, yeah 120 degrees should be that. And set to radial. Okay. Uh, now moving on to the drop shadow. Uh, blend mode no, uh, multiply opacity 75%, angle 128. Distance we want about 8. Spread about 0. Size 40 to 42. Excuse 42. Um, contour just normal, no noise. Now we're into the main part, which is the gradient overlay. That's the 100%. Uh, angle 90, everything should be fine. Just want to change the gradient first. Stop to the white again. We're going to create the same gradient as we did for the uh, first one. So you've got C, C, F, D, 0. And that is your glossy metallic. Um, effect sort of thing done. Uh, you can reduce the stroke, I think it's a bit thick to be honest, on 8 out of 5. Just do it. So that's it guys, thanks for watching. Um, I'll be doing a new tutorial soon, should be out within a few days or the next or the week. So, so guys, bye.